I'll do one more example and then tell you what the general pattern really is looking like here mathematically. Uh, mobile phones, okay, IMEI, the so-called International Mobile Equipment Identity Number, somebody steals your phone or you lose it, this is what you have to cancel. Okay, uh, changing it, so if you look inside the phone, it's this long number here. Changing it uh, in the UK is a criminal offence. Okay, to change uh, this number on a phone is a criminal offence. And it has a structure of 14 digits plus uh, a check digit. Okay, there's a software version that you occasionally see which has got more digits. So it's this nasty little tiny number looking here. So what you do, uh, here's what it looks like. Okay, and there's going to be a check digit right at the end. You take every other number and you double it. So we've seen this before. Double the nine, double the one, double the four, double the zero, double the seven, you get 14. Okay, as before, if you get two digits, add them together. So 18 turns into nine, 14 into five. And then you add everything together. So the, the other digits were left alone add everything together and you get 52, okay, and the check digit is going to be the extra number uh, that you need to make that sum divisible by 10. So 52 plus 8 is going to be divisible by 10. So that's the final number that's on your IMEI. Uh,